Keep watching Charis TV. Good morning, everyone. Uh, this is Lavonia of Philander, and this is my husband Raymond Dion Philander. Uh, we are we are honored to be here, at Charis Ministry. Um, we thank God for the opportunity, and uh, we just want to say uh, that we have we have discovered. Uh, Cherry's ministry through YouTube. Uh, uh, my husband was actually uh, my husband actually discovered uh, Cherry's ministry through YouTube, and then uh, we've we've come about to love the, the the videos that we've watched because it's inspiring, and then I'm sure everybody who's gonna watch it will also be in inspired by it. So uh, uh, we're coming from Bloemfontein, and. Uh, our we came here uh, at Cherry's Manager be, uh, because of our challenges that we've been having. And first of all, our challenges were cause uh, a death curse in our family, and the second uh, was about uh, a fruit of the womb, uh, like struggling to conceive w uh, within the time that we've been together, uh, and then it's breakthrough in in our financial life in receiving a house that uh, that we've been struggling with amen i've been trusting in god uh, since the moment that we've been together and i've seen that i've been struggling to conceive because a man of god said that i, I have lost a child and then it's true and that's uh when that's when that's when it started when we when we uh, been together and then it's, he also prophesied that uh, because of our marriages that uh, there are a lot of people against it so uh, I just want to thank God and that we are going to receive the baby so it's like mm. like now yeah. <laughs> so we had an opportunity to see the man of God and it was for fruit of the womb it was a uh, financial breakthrough and it was for the house and then it's death, he, in, the, death in the funeral spirit. death of the uh, yeah and then it's for a uh, business business breakthrough as well yeah receiving so business when, when i saw him today the first uh, like and when he saw me it was first about uh, me uh, losing a ch uh, losing a child and into conceiving and then I told him, yes, it's true that I've lost a child and then uh, I have been crying to God about conceiving because it felt like I was failing. So, but but uh, the man of God prophesied and said that we shall receive our baby. And then uh, he asked me about my sister as well. My sister passed away now uh, recently. recently. And then he's, uh, he prophesied that it's a, a curse in the family. So uh, as well in my husband's, uh, as well as my hus in my husband's family. So, but it is broken. It's just that we need to pray about it a lot. But I know God already has broken every chain in the name of Jesus. So, uh, and then it's about uh, the breakthrough in the in our in our in receiving the house that we that we've been wanting in because recently where we are staying is is like we've been crying to receive our own house and then I know we're going better to house. receive we're gonna get a better house okay. amen so yeah and then receiving uh, starting a business mm. that even if it's small but eventually God will brought it out and then it will go mm. bigger so yeah we thank God for that as well Amen. Glory be to God. Well, while I was standing, he, he told me to stand up. I went, stand up, stood before men of God, and he told me to put my hands uh, on top of my stomach. And then I, 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 I put my hands on top of my stomach, and then while he was praying for me, uh, I felt like uh, I felt like something was moving, moving out of me. So it's like it. I felt it twice while it was praying for me but uh, when I went to check it was like a yellowish discharge that I normally don't have and then I, I thank God that mm -hmm. I know that everything that was bo uh, was bound like and everything that held it back for me to conceive I'm, I, we are going to conceive in mm -hmm. the name of Jesus so
It's like we couldn't believe what the man of God was saying to us, prophesying to us, because it's very rare that when you meet someone for the first time that you that never know that doesn't know you to reveal a lot of things that you only know about yourself. So it was really a blessed, honored day to have met him. Amen. Amen. Um, uh, what I would tell the person to uh, to sing this video is that God is real, God is alive, mm -hmm. and that He will speak life into your situation when it feels like it's dried up and nobody nobody's there to listen or to heal that wounds. So I, I, I encourage that person that God is alive. Just keep on praying because prayer is uh, prayer is the main factor in life. 